Monday! <laughs> Happy second day master class. Welcome back. I see some faces that were here yesterday. I see some new faces. Hello, Medici TV land, land, land. Um, it's so excited to be back here. We had a really phenomenal morning again this morning. Uh, really, what is so wonderful about these three days is that they we get a, a, a line, a thread of continuity. Because sometimes when I've done classes and you get 15 or 20 minutes with a singer, it feels like a drive-by shooting in a way. And they're like, I got it. And then, wait, what just happened? So that's what I love about these three days is that we get to go deeper. And today will be a continuation of, of what we started yesterday. Thank you so much for creating this safe space that I had asked you for yesterday and we will ask you for today and tomorrow and for every performance that you attend. Um, creating your job, creating a space safe where the magic, a, spa a safe place where the magic can happen. That you let us know that you're on our side and you're ready for something spectacular helps us breathe more easily. And that's where that expansive space for creation happens, which is kind of magic when it happens. Um, a tiny logistical thing. Um, I imagine some of you here are headed downstairs for the gala afterwards. Um, we are going to stop at about 5.45, which gives you 15 calm, easy minutes to go downstairs. Our singers will be attending as well. I'm so excited for them to hear everybody. Heard the rehearsal today, Tammy Wilson, the winner this year, she's going to blow your mind. She's amazing. Those of you who do not have tickets, download the Medici app on your phone so you can follow because it's going to be live at 6 o'clock. Um, and so you can follow along there. It will also be online for a while. I'll take a few questions just to squeeze out a little bit. And then at 5.55, I say sayonara. I dash off and got to squeeze into a gown <laughs> and warm up. So we're going to get right to it, and we are going to go back and visit Donna Anna with Susanna. Uh, good afternoon. My name is Susanna Waddington, and I'll be singing Non Mi Dear from Don Giovanni by Mozart. We heard it all yesterday. Can we just get to work? Yes. First of all, this is exciting. I mean, it is, but yes, I'm also glad that you and I are on the same page. <laughs> you and I are so on the same page. Oh, good. And it's very exciting because um, the extraordinary thing about opera singers, even though we get a bad rap sometimes of being stupid, any conductor that says, oh, okay, musicians, singers, I'm like, no! Oh! <laughs> um, 
what we have to process, physical, vocal, psychological, emotional, technical, linguistical. <laughs> it's a word. Um, and then to sort of process it in front of people. In front of people, not even in the privacy of your own home where you get to kind of tap it out and try, yeah. yeah. And I just feel like this has stepped into a different place already. Do you feel that? Yeah. How does it feel? Um, like I said, it was vulnerable yesterday, and like, but yesterday it was almost an uncomfortable vulnerability, and today it's a more comfortable vulnerability. And I know that I can take it further, but at least it feels comfortable. <laughs> yeah. You sort of tipped into it yesterday, and you went, oh, okay, the earth didn't fall off its axis. <laughs> I didn't trigger a nuclear war. <laughs> Mozart didn't come back from the grave and, <laughs> and say, how dare you sing my music, music, music. And okay, okay, ah, okay, ah, oh, we, okay, but now you have both feet in it, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. This is good. This is a huge psychological step. And that is never to be underestimated in, in the kind of tools we need to stand up here and do what we do, okay? This, we talked a lot this morning about mental preparation and visualizing what's happening and actually letting the judgment and the inner voice stop, but letting the brain um, absorb and, and um, Find, sort of find the path for us, plow the, the path. If you can engage, this is a long discussion, but engaging your brain fully in that kind of mental exercise, there's no space for, but you did it, you know, and all that, that nonsense that gets in our way and inhibits us. You, um, you're going there, and the more you go there, the easier it is, and the more confidence you get. It's not magic, it's not, Belong, something that belongs to everybody else. It's a technique that you just have to learn and apply some discipline to it and apply some regular desire to go there and then it starts blossoming and the roots grow deeper and then the flowers come and all that stuff. And then there's a tempest and a hurricane and it wipes <laughs> it all away, but you at least know where to go <laughs> to get that. Mm -hmm. And it will come. There, it, that's the welcome to life. Now, now we start. Okay. First thing, can you do your introduction one more time? One more time. <laughs> okay. Good evening, my name is Susanna Waddington and I will be singing Non Mi Dear from Mozart's Don Giovanni. Ah, okay, thank you. Because last time, hello, my name is Susanna Waddington and I, <laughs> who, don't look at me. <laughs> well, you're still here, so I'll make eye contact again, yeah. right? Now do it one more time. And don't tell me what you're singing. Tell me what your favorite thing to do on summer vacation is. With my name introduction yeah, or just? Yeah, sure. Oh, okay. <laughs> or your nickname or what you, you know, whatever. Okay. Tell us something about you. Hello, my name is Susanna Waddington. And in the summertime, I like to go swimming because when I was a little girl, I thought I was a mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> is Susanna Waddington and I would like to sing part of your world. <laughs> I bet you did. You even have the hair. Yeah, and it was longer when I was little, so. Oh my god, I love that. And it's the same thing. Mm -hmm. My name is Susanna. I love to swim. Actually, I still sometimes feel like a mermaid. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm gonna sing Non Mi Dear from Mozart's Don Giovanni. Mm -hmm. It's that. You talk to us. Don't present it. Talk to us. Mm -hmm. And you show us who you are. And that immediately is connect. The mask is off. Mm -hmm. And we always know when the mask is on. So you come in. I know there's a protocol. Hello, my name is Joyce DiDonato. Uh, you know, I know mm -hmm. that. But do the protocol, but do it as you. Mm -hmm. And talk to them. 
my favorite song is Part of, Part of Your World, because I used to dream about being mermaid. And now I'd like to sing Donna Anna's <laughs> Non Mi Quiero. <laughs> okay, just do it one more time. Just talk to us. Yeah. Do you want and me to find, include find that? <laughs> or just say, me. just give an introduction okay. and somehow end up at Non Mi Dear, but find one person to talk to in the audience. Okay. Good evening. My name is Susanna Waddington, and I will be singing Non Mi Dear from Mozart's Don Giovanni. Now we see you. We see you. Mm -hmm. And what that does now, because the mask is off, is we're going to hear you. You're starting, you're telling your brain, you're telling your body, we're doing this as me. That's the worst grammatical sentence structure <laughs> ever. <laughs> but we, heart, mind, soul, body, voice, we're going to jump off the cliff and do this as us, mm -hmm. as me. However, how many, however many of you there are. <laughs> <laughs> I've got 12. No. <laughs> okay? Mm -hmm. Now, let's sing. Okay. from this morning, mm -hmm. every millisecond of that sound is getting this swirling, okay, and every consonant, every through, every, not one millisecond of breaking that up, connecting, and... It's a ribbon, it's pulling out of your heart. Just you stay there and it's just troppo mi spiace lontanarne un ben che lungamente la nostra alma desia. Okay, la nostra alma de all lots of little micro beats okay. in there. Because what we don't want is la nostra Landing. La nostra alma desire. Everything in there. Okay? When I, so when this orchestra starts, it's like, <gasps> it's pouring out of your heart, mm -hmm. like hot lava. Can you start la ghetto? Feel that. Feel it. Come here. Troppo mi Go, it's pouring out, it's weeping out of your heart. Every syllable, it's activated down here. My mondo and tung. Even through the N of mondo, it's swirling and tung. Okay, but also through the end of that E vowel. Oh, D. Don't land. Oh, D. Through everything and my mondo. The eel and mm. go, go, go. Through all those things and Right 
there and me. Good, now, all right. <laughs> this is a lot more like energy and work that has to go into it. It's opera. Yeah, I know. <laughs> It's more than I've put in, so it's just like, it feels really awesome, but it's like, oh. I bet it feels yeah. awesome. Hello, body. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> yeah. The rest of your body is going, finally. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where are you working? What do you mean? Where are you feeling the effort, oh, the work? Um, more in like my abdominal core area, which mm -hmm. is like we talked about in breath class that that's where I need to be accessing mm -hmm. for my breath, like my lower abdominal versus keeping it up here. So it's good, it means I know it's working. Yeah, are yeah. you feeling anything here? Mm -mm. <sighs> Lucky you. <laughs> <laughs> where else are you working? Well, I mean, my I feel like my entire body is involved in it and not yeah. just <laughs> this. Yeah. If the rest of your body is all doing that, this doesn't have to do anything. Yeah. Where else are you working? <laughs> um, in my mind, but yeah. not overworking. You're working, <laughs> I would propose, mm -hmm. at least the result says this, efficiently. And you're working with all the mentality to actually bring you success. A successful phrase, a successful mm -hmm. note. You're employing all of this in the direction, in the engagement, in the release, in the breath. You never looked away from me. Mm -hmm. But you weren't thinking, don't look away, don't look away, don't, don't <laughs> break, I, I want to, don't break. You were thinking breath, 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 crudeli non mi dir this, and this is the perfect example of if your brain is working in the right direction, in a proactive way, phonate, engage, go deeper, release. There's no space for the other stuff. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? And I've, I've talked about this before. We think we're being diligent students and diligent musicians if we're critiquing ourselves the whole time. Because that's what we've been taught from our teachers and our conductors and all this. Nope, nope, you missed the beat. Nope, you're behind. Nope, you missed the But we think that's being diligent. That's just self-destruction. Because if that's where your mind is, then you're looking away, oh, I missed that, oh, I got that, okay, here comes the hard part, and you're like this computer chip that's malfunctioning. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I'll tell you, you're not doing anything but giving breath to these vocal lines, and I see Donna Anna. We see Donna Anna. So there's not a matter of doing something. I th I, my impression from you is that you need some time on stage, you need good stage directors to work out, and you just need some, some physical work about how to present everything that you feel. Mm -hmm. That's a skill. That's th you're gonna learn that, that's gonna come. But the cool thing is, by standing here, knowing that you belong here, by showing us who you are, and taking that wild, wacky leap off the cliff to show, that, show us that, so brave. And then engaging in all this positive stuff, that's all we need. Because we get Donna Anna and we get glorious musicality and vocality. Are you feeling that? Yeah. I'm feeling it too, thank you. It feels good. <laughs> let's go back to the rest of it and let's carry on and see, okay. and see where this goes. So again, what are we talking about? Um, we're talking about mental engagement in terms of proactive things that are gonna feed your music and mm -hmm. your voice and then the emotion and the text and all of that. Right. Do me just one favor, stay mm -hmm. right there. Would you start? Think. Just, we're gonna, you just play your thing and I want you oh, to okay. think everything. <laughs> okay. And I want you to feel where all of this music is, mm -hmm. okay? Do that one more time. The same two passages. Da -da. Da -da. Feel this change. Da. Question. Now. 
here, weeping. It's like melting, weeping lava. Just feel it in your body. Don't act it. Feel how it... One more time, and I want you to feel that question. Crudeli tadam. Okay. Do you see how you ask a question yeah. and it's given back to you in the orchestra? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This, all this orchestra is you. Yeah. It's all that emotion that you have never, you said yesterday, Donna Anna doesn't express her feelings. She's not allowed to be vulnerable. And it's been pent up all this time and, mm -hmm. okay? You've been raped. You've not been allowed to scream. You might have liked it. It's horrifying. You're horrified with yourself. And you're horrified that Don Otavio's sitting here loving you and, and you can't accept it. To push it away. And you're trying to do it in the right way. So all of this is you. And if you don't internalize it, you're not going to go deep enough. Okay? <laughs> It's coming out. Every word. Keep subdividing those things so it keeps moving. Every syllable, every nanosecond. Sorry for yourself. Pour it out. Here. Nobody understands. Melt. 
Look at one thing. No, look at me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm you, only without the extraordinary one. Um, <laughs> do you want another shot? Sure. <laughs> This is not, this is, I st I'm still a little embarrassed. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Say thank you, George. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. However you want to do it, but open. Mm -hmm. Okay? Generous. You, generosity here. He plays this unbelievably. <laughs> One more time. I just want to see this. This is just, you are a joy because you're opening. And it's so beautiful. And the least interesting thing for me is what it does to your voice. But what it does to your voice is thrilling. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the least interesting thing about all of this. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you're going to have an opera career. I told them this morning it's the least interesting thing to me. I don't care. I'd love it if that's what you're meant to do and you really want it, then of course I'd love it. But if you can open here, that's something you're going to take into your life in every, everything that you have. That's the goal. Mm -hmm. And if you can open up in your life, let's talk this through. You open up in your life, you're going to experience things in a way that is, look at, like you saw how hard it was for you to look up and hold it. Mm -hmm. That's opening. It was hard for you, but you did it. 
as I was yelling at you. <laughs> but you did it. Force yourself to do it. Even if you don't end up doing it in performance, see what that feels like jumping off that cliff. <gasps> oh God, they're really looking at me. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let it. <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. And so if you start to see the world this way, instead of just, don't look at me, right? You start to see it, you're gonna see things you didn't even know were there. And things are gonna come to you that you didn't even know were there. Then what might happen is you have a much richer palette of life to bring to the stage. You're not bringing a Donna Anna that only knows apology. You're bringing a Donna Anna who is fragile and has been scared and is nev has not known what it is to open, but finally it cracks and you'll have access to that. So this is it's why I've always said the theater has been the best teacher of my life, because I have to do things here. And I, I'm glad I can do it on stage, but the real interest for me is what it looks like when I exit the stage door, or backstage, or whatever. And this thing that you're giving to yourself is the gift that you're, you're giving to yourself is, is going to keep giving. And because you've become richer, Imagine then what you're going to be giving to us. Wow, now that I'll pay money for. <laughs> yeah, beautiful sound. I don't, I can, I can put on my Apple Music and I'm all good. <laughs> but this kind of experience, this is, is, this merits charging $300 a ticket. Okay? Mm -hmm. So what I'm saying it is, it will work for your opera career as well, <laughs> yeah. which is in, in spades it will, but it's going to work for your life. This is, it's, it's thrilling. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.